Hello and welcome to Home Cooking Spain. Today I'm going to be cooking an easy recipe, um, rice with fried eggs. So let's begin. Right, so let's do this. I've got my spinning pot here with some water and I'll turn the heat on. That's for the rice by the way. Let's work the heat up full high and wait for that to start bubbling. And this one here, I'm going to turn up to number seven and I'll add about three, four tablespoons good old olive oil and we'll wait for this to just slightly heat up. Right, so once the oil is sort of hotish, I'm going to add some cayenne peppers. I really hope that my wife doesn't notice. And some um, coloured peppercorns. And we'll just let them there to fry for a minute or so. Right, so let's stir this about a bit. The cayenne peppers, I like to squash them so the seeds come out. Whoa, that one jumped. Okay, so once once the couple of minutes are over, I'm going to add some... By the way, the hot stuff that I'm adding today, it's optional. I'm going to add the some onion. And what I'm adding now, you can add as much or as less as you like. Some garlic, some red pepper, I'll leave a link, and green pepper, I'll leave a link below to show you how I freeze my peppers. And all this, we'll just fry it up until it's all nice and soft. So, while this is doing, I can see that my water is starting to boil, so I'm going to add the rice in and I'll put some salt. And we'll boil the rice up for about 10 minutes roughly. And of course, we'll move this about every now and then, so it gets done on all sides. You like my spinning pot? Yeah, that's nearly done. Okay, so once this is done, it's all starting to brown up nicely. What I'll do is add, I'm going to add some salt first. And I'm going to add a teaspoon of sweet paprika. And I'm going to add some piri piri sauce. Basically this is very similar to Tabasco but only costs one euro whereas Tabasco costs nearly four euros for the same quantity which is just under 200 mil. So I'll just add a couple of drops, oops I really hope my wife doesn't notice that and I'll mix that all in And um, my rice is done, so I'm just going to give that a rinse.
Oh, that smells really good. And you know what? Sod it. As I'm going to end up in the doghouse for a month, I might, I might as well add in a couple of these chilies. Yay! Lovely jubbly! Okay, so once the rice has been rinsed, I'm going to chuck it in here. And I'm just going to mix it all about and give it a good stir fry for about five minutes. Okay, so that's my wife friendly stir fried rice done. So, swap pans over and I'm going to chuck in some olive oil, about three or four tablespoons, maybe six, and we'll just heat that up slightly. And while that heats up, I'm going to chuck this, some of it, on a plate. Right, so this oil seems hot. If it isn't, it doesn't matter. So I'm going to crack my pair of eggs in here and fry them up. That's one. And that's the other. And I'll also add in a bit of salt. Okay, so let's do my eggs. Someone said the other day, they left me a comment on one of my short videos saying I shouldn't use plastic to fry my eggs. Obviously they don't know that these are made for frying eggs and they're, they're heat proof, I think to about 400 degrees, 600 Fahrenheit or something like that. But anyway, they made them for frying eggs. I've been using these for 40 years. I've never had a problem. So these eggs are sorted. So what I'll do is take them out. And by the way, olive oil is good for you. So it doesn't matter how much I use. That's another moan that someone did. So there's lunch for today. Right, just sort this out and I'll end the video up.